Hello everyone, I am Christopher and today I'm going to teach you guys how to protect yourselves from getting banned by blocking Nintendo servers. So for this method, we're going to go into our settings, internet, internet settings, and as you can see I'm already connected to a network, so we're just going to select OK, change settings, and we're going to go to DNS settings. We're going to change them from automatic to manual. And we're going to want to input these DNS numbers right here. Yours should all be zeros and you can replace them with these. If you live in America or close to America, you're going to want to use these DNS settings right here. If you live in or around Europe, you're going to want to reverse these DNS settings. So your secondary DNS will be your primary DNS and your primary DNS will be your secondary DNS. I'll have the DNS numbers down below. Now that that's set up, we're going to hit save. If you haven't been connected to the internet at all on your modded Nintendo Switch, you're going to want to select your network and it's going to ask for your password. You're going to need to input the incorrect password with at least eight characters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to select OK and it's going to try to connect to the internet. Once you get the unable to connect to network error, select OK. You're going to want to select close. And then instead of re-entering your password, you're going to go view network settings. Now that you're at your network settings, you're going to go to DNS settings, change from automatic to manual, and you're going to want to input those numbers that I provided earlier. Once you have these numbers in, you're going to want to select save. Then you're going to want to try to connect to the internet again. And since we put the wrong password, we won't be able to connect, so we're going to select OK. Close. Re-enter password. Once you input the correct password, you're going to connect to the internet. Alright, now we're going to go back home. And as you can see, we're connected to the internet. The way to test if you did this correctly is by going to Nintendo eShop and then selecting it. And as you can see, we got this could not display page. That means you did it correctly. You no longer have access to Nintendo servers. So you won't accidentally connect to Nintendo and get your Nintendo Switch banned. Another alternative to block Nintendo servers is by using 90DNS. So we're going to click on the link I provide down below and we're going to download Switch 90DNS Setter NRO. You're also going to want to download Switch 90DNS Tester. We'll need this for later. Alright, so we're going to open up our Switch folder on our SD card. Then we're going to drag Switch 90DNS Setter NRO to our Switch folder. You're also going to want to drag your Switch 90 DNS tester into your Switch folder. Now that that's done, we're going to eject our SD card. We're going to inject the payload. Now we're going to go into our album and we're going to do 90 DNS setter. Once it's open, we're going to press X to apply 90 DNS to all Wi-Fi networks. Now that that's done, we're going to press Y to reboot. Now that we're rebooted, we're going to check our system settings. Then we're going to want to check our internet network settings. And as you can see, our primary DNS and secondary DNS have changed. So we know it worked. Another method of testing to make sure that it worked is by going to your album and selecting 90 DNS tester. And as you can see, all of these servers are blocked, so we're good to go. And that's just one way of protecting yourself from getting banned on your Nintendo Switch. If this tutorial has helped you, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.